Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to talk about the walk-in. The walk-in is essential part of your aiming and many players underestimate the walk-in. You're gonna see the details in the walk-in which are crucial to get on the line. So the walk-in is super important part of the aiming and first of all we have to find the line when standing behind the shot and from this point you have to get on the line with good walk-in. If your walk-in is not good there is very high chance that while you're walking into the shot you go offline and then you're not going to be on the line when you're down on the shot. Many players are not walking in straight and this is this is the problem I will show a few examples of going offline while you walk in first of all I'm going to show you the good walking so I'm perfectly behind the line with my hips and shoulders square to the line and from here what I'm going to be concentrated on is my head to go down as straight as possible this is the very important thing that you have to think about it so my head is going to go absolutely straight and my eyes are going to be on the brown so this was good walking my head was straight what i see is players are going offline with their head and there are a few reasons reasons why that happens now i'll show you what i mean i'll use my cue as a guide so you you can see what i mean so now i'm on the line yeah and from here the player goes a little bit to the left and now the player is not on the line very common mistake for right-handed players is they go fraction left when they walk in and of course they're not going to be on the line so now watch carefully watch my head so my head here is on the line here is on the line but now my head is not on the line and then when I go down obviously I'm not on the line I'm overdoing it now so you can see that really I'm not on the line now and of course if I hit the ball I'm going to miss here I'm going to show you the first reason why your head can go offline and of course the cue is going to be offline as well so i'm using the rest here on the floor to show you the line and i'm using my cue like this to show you the line now right foot right foot steps forward and now watch what happens when the left foot steps so you have to be very careful with your left foot if your left foot brings the head with it then you're gonna be offline so you have to be very careful with the step with the left foot because the left foot can drag your head offline and then you're gonna be offline and miss the pot remember that many right-handed players they're offline in that direction the tip of the cue points a little bit more to the right and the butt of the cue is a bit more to the left so while you step with your left foot you have to be very careful your head to stay on the line okay see my my left foot is not going too much to the left i don't allow the left foot to drag my head to the left as well So the second thing that can put you offline while you walk in is your shoulders. There are some players who are walking in with the cue first. And this is, this is okay, this is something that can work. Neil Robertson walks in like that, Kyron Wilson walks in like that. They're getting the cue like this and they walk in. 
but be careful with your shoulders rotation. You have to rotate your shoulders to be able to be in good stance when you're down on the shot, but shoulders rotation can put you offline. So now watch me. And now I'm offline because I rotate my shoulders too much and I rotate my shoulders too early. Watch how John Higgins walks in. He walks in with right foot, left foot, shoulders are still square to the line, and then he rotates the shoulders. So he's doing everything to keep his head straight, going down straight. Now watch me. Right foot, left foot, shoulders are still square to the line, my head is perfectly on the line, and then I rotate my shoulders. Okay, so I'm not rotating my shoulders too early. Now I'm going to do it natural without stopping, so you can see the walking. And now I'm perfectly on the line. So first thing is be careful with your left foot. Second is be careful your shoulders rotation not to put you offline. Here I'll give you the yellow for example because for right-handed player the yellow is a little bit tough in terms of stance because you have to lay on the table. Remember that the most important is to keep your head going down straight and this is the bonus tip. To help your head going down straight try to fix your eyes on the object ball while you walk in. This is going to help you to go as straight as you can and to be on the line. So now my eyes on, on, on the yellow, eyes on the yellow, eyes on the yellow, eyes on the yellow, and now on the cue ball. Here I'm doing my feathers, pose. Stay down a little bit after the shot. And then hopefully you can clear the table from here. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like the videos, share them, and see you in my next video. Bye.